To measure ohms or resistance with a multimeter, start by verifying that no current is flowing through the circuit or component that you would like to test. Power it off, unplug it from the wall, and remove any batteries if necessary. If you have not already done so, plug the black probe into the COM port on your multimeter and the red probe into the voltage omega milliamp port. Turn your multimeter to resistance mode, usually denoted by the omega symbol. Set your range as necessary. When in doubt, set your range high. You can always reduce it later if required unless your meter has auto range. To test, place one probe on each end of the circuit or component that you would like to test. Since resistance is non-directional, it does not matter which probe goes where. If your multimeter reads close to zero, then your range is probably set too high. Adjust your range to a lower setting and try again. If you set the range too low, your multimeter may display 1 or OL, indicating an open loop. You will need to increase your range to get a proper reading. This may also mean that your circuit or component does not have continuity. A non-continuous circuit will always read 1 or OL when testing. Also, when measuring resistors in circuit, know that the value you read will usually be less than the rating printed on the component, either the color code or actual printed value if it's a precision resistor. To get a more accurate reading of a resistor, it will be necessary to pull one end of it out of circuit to do so. Visit galco.com to see our full selection of multimeters and more.